guys, Karen here with another La Crusade video and welcome back to our channel. And as you can tell by the title today, I will be going over the items that I purchased in 2022, right before we go into 2023. Um, so um, I'm going to take you through, I'm going to try and do it in order, but not quite sure if that's how I purchased them. But I do know for sure the first item that I purchased uh, in 2022 was the deep Dutch oven in the color meringue. Um, yeah, and also I'll be sure to tell you which one is my favorite out of 2022. So the deep, I already had a deep Dutch oven in the color flame. Um, I thought it was slightly different when I saw it because it looked a little bit bigger, but then when I, when it came in, in the mail, I did do a video about that. I was kind of like confused. But then with all of you guys' help, I realized that this was the same deep Dutch oven that I already had. It was not the round Dutch oven, um, which meant that that was going to go back on the list. Um, the round Dutch oven will probably be on my 2023 list. But overall, I really uh, do like this color. Um, you can't see it in the video, but if you, ha if you don't have the color meringue, uh, it goes from this light color into a very light like uh, pink, which is very pretty. And it was the first light color that I had purchased. So it's a really good pot. I purchased it when it was $250. It is currently on sale for 200 uh, when I purchased it I believe there were 12 colors available but now there's probably four or three um, when I last checked so great pot if you don't have it you might want to put it on your 2023 wish list up next is the paella pan um, this had been on my list since 2021 I believe when I saw it when I first saw it and as many of you know, I was kind of on the fence as to whether to purchase it. Well, it's come in handy for so many. I use it, I, I use it most often for rice dishes, and you know, I do a couple of vegetable. You you do kind of like vegetable fries in here, um, in terms of sautéing and what have you. Um, really great pan, um, and it's so I forgot the price that I paid for it but I bought it during the factory to table sale. So this is when you'll primarily find the paella pan here. Um, and it's the color Soleil. I did not have this color, so I decided that that's the color that we would choose. And so far, so good. Um, and I do believe this was my second purchase of 2022. Um, also during that same factory to table sale, I purchased two trivets. Now, I will say these are like becoming little workhorses, literally, especially uh, we saw how much we use them when we have company, um, holidays. I am determined to put these on the list for 2023, um, which I have not completed my whole wish list for 2023 yet, but I will share that in an upcoming video. But these, I will likely have two more on there. Um, and from what I understand, from what I have seen, I've only seen them available during the factory to table sale. So most definitely I'll be trying to find these for the upcoming year. The other thing that I purchased was the European butter dish. It has come in handy. It holds two um, sticks of butter. Um, we've used it. Uh, I let it sit out. It's done its job. It's well worth the money if you're looking for something just to hold your items. And then last but not least, I purchased the soup pot. It's seven and a half quarts for $300. It is still currently on sale. Not as many colors available though. Actually, no, I think the only color that's not available is the chiffon pink. Now, out of all of these, uh, the one that I would purchase again, besides the trivets, would be the soup pot. This is this is game changer when um i if it stays around 300 dollars, i might have to get this again does anybody else feel like that like this may i might have to have two of these because this has really done the job like um that one i did not expect because of its size to use it as often as i do but out of 2022 
My favorite item for 2022 would be the La Creuset soup pot in seven and a half quarts for $300. This, this is my 2022 favorite. Um, if they have it for the same price uh, in the new year, even if it's just for a couple of months, that would be fabulous um, because it is a really good buy. That's the one I'm pleased with all of the purchases, but that's my favorite out of 2022. Well, guys, let me know what your favorite item was for this year that you purchased and leave it in the comments below. And I'm wishing you all a happy holidays and I hope you all had a very Merry Christmas and I will see you in the next video. Bye.